At the center of this big factory in the Netherlands, in the midst of a months-long assembly process, there's a revolutionary machine that the whole world has come to rely on. Each machine costing up to $200 million, only five customers can afford to buy EUV systems. Micron, SK Hynix, Samsung, Intel, and TSMC. The last three making up nearly 84% of ASML's business. Experts say it could take decades for any other company to catch up, not only because of ASML's proprietary tech, but because it's built complex, often exclusive deals with nearly 800 suppliers. Its stock has skyrocketed since 2018. ASML, a leading company in the semiconductor equipment sector, reported financial results exceeding expectations for the second quarter, driven by increased demand for artificial intelligence, AI chips. ASML's net sales reached 6.24 billion euros, $6.8 billion, surpassing the forecast of 6.03 billion euros. Net profit also exceeded expectations, standing at 1.58 billion euros compared to the estimated 1.43 billion euros. You could see an EUV machine right behind me. The size of a city bus, but working with atomic level precision, these EUV lithography machines are the most expensive step in making every advanced microchip that powers the modern digital age data centers, cars, and every single iPhone. Despite a 9.5% year-on-year decline in net sales and an 18.7% decrease in net profit, these results represent an improvement over previous quarters. Net bookings, a key indicator of machinery orders, reached 5.6 billion euros in the June quarter, marking a 24% increase compared to the previous year. This highlights growing interest in ASML's advanced equipment, essential for the production of next-generation semiconductors. ASML is renowned for its production of extreme ultraviolet EUV lithography machines, essential tools for manufacturing the most advanced chips. These tools are crucial for technological evolution and to meet the growing demand for semiconductors used in various sectors, including artificial intelligence. Today, ASML has a monopoly on the fabrication of EUV lithography machines, the most advanced type of lithography equipment that's needed to make every single advanced processor chip that we use today. And this company is one of the most extraordinary organizations in the world. The machines that they produce, each one of them is among the most complicated devices ever made. In 2024, ASML has described the year as a transition period anticipating a recovery in the semiconductor sector after a challenging 2023. The company has maintained its annual forecasts, expecting net sales in the third quarter to be between 6.7 billion euros and 7.3 billion euros. Christophe Bouquet, CEO of ASML, stated that despite macroeconomic uncertainties, sector recovery is anticipated in the second half of the year, with AI driving much of this recovery. ASML faces several geopolitical challenges, particularly due to export restrictions imposed by the Dutch government under pressure from the United States. These restrictions aim to limit China's access to advanced chip manufacturing technologies. Although ASML has never supplied EUV machines to China, the restrictions have impacted the company's sales in the country with an anticipated reduction of 10 to 15% in sales in China this year. We are the only provider on the planet of this critical technology. These machines are the only way to print minuscule designs on these chips. They cost up to $200 million, and they're only made by a single company, Advanced Semiconductor Materials Lithography, or ASML. Despite these restrictions, China accounted for 49% of ASML's sales in the second quarter, maintaining a critical role in the company's business. 
This delicate balance between market opportunities and geopolitical limitations continues to be a crucial factor in ASML's strategy. Looking ahead, ASML anticipates a cyclical recovery in the semiconductor sector by 2025. The construction of new semiconductor manufacturing plants, such as those by Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company and Samsung in the United States, represents a significant opportunity for the company. These new factories, strategically located globally, will be crucial for the demand for ASML's machines. Said, hey, we might be late in delivering our modules to you guys because we cannot get the chips. And we said, well, if we cannot get the chips, we cannot make the machines to make more chips. So there's a catch-22. Huh? We're still managing, keep our fingers crossed, but it's a daily struggle. Ben Barringer, a technology analyst at Quilter Cheviot, noted that while AI currently represents a relatively small portion of ASML's revenue, significant growth is expected in the near future. The continuous expansion of AI and related technological sectors could thus be a crucial driver for the company. In practice, as ASML navigates between growth opportunities and geopolitical challenges, the company remains optimistic about its future prospects. Technological innovation and global expansion will continue to be the pillars of ASML's strategy, with artificial intelligence driving much of the recovery and growth in the semiconductor sector. If you found this analysis useful, subscribe to the channel. See you soon.